Hi there and welcome back to our How to Use Anna 2. In this one we're going to take a look at our macro controls. So we have four macro controls down here and each of these can be used to assign a few different parameters to the one control. So if I want to say assign my filter I'll right click on it and I could also assign sync and say the sub as well I'll just turn our GM off so we can hear this so you can see the assignments when you go into the matrix window and you go into it by just clicking on mod here you're going to see the assignments that we've made and we can make a whole bunch of assignments to all different parameters um, including effects so let me put some effects on and we'll use the output assigned to macro one um, one of the cool features with our macros is we can actually rename these. So if I click here, you can actually rename it. And you can actually have two lines. So if I want to have two lines, I'll write line one. And then if I do two spaces and then line two, it actually gives us two lines. And if we go into our settings panel, we can actually see our macro names here. And we can also learn a MIDI control. So I can click the learn button and change my MIDI controls. Or you can actually go in and freely assign them to any of the MIDI control numbers. And you can do that for all four macros. So it's very easy to assign those to a controller and have them control stuff. And most of the presets built into Anna's factory bank should have some macros already assigned. So there you go, that is macros in Anna 2. In the next video we're going to take a look at the EQ. Thanks everybody for watching, commenting and indeed liking. We really do appreciate all the support we get here on our Sonic Academy YouTube channel. So if you find this video super useful, please, we'd love you to hit the subscribe button. We update the uh, YouTube channel every week with new content. And if you want to watch some more relevant content, just click on the videos beside me.